I think I hurt my leg. Oh, no. Ah, what's up, little squirrel fella? Ah, we showed him, didn't we? Yeah, that was a piece of cake. Yeah, it was actually. I make the change. Uh, um, <laughs> I don't think I like the sound of that music. I don't think I like the sound of that music either. <laughs> Susie, nine millimeter. I'm right here, sweetie pie. You just tell me where to shoot. Oh no, I move really slow now because of my hurt leg. this fight. <laughs> it's just been a long time. I think I need to get him to hit these pipes. <sighs> well, sure glad we grabbed those tails earlier. And push the giant button on its back. And again, the law of video games dictates that we have to do it three times. Nah, I went on a little too early. You are terminated. We definitely showed him that time. Um, hey, Frankie. Frankie, where's he gone? Oh, no. <laughs> Uh, Mr. Squirrel, I think I'm a gardener. You don't look too good. Um, you may be all right. What do you mean, all right? Look at me. I'm broken in two. 
I'm just firewood from now. They'll be using me as toothpicks before you know it. No, you'll be all right. Come on. What are you going to do? Well, I got an idea. Okay, let's see. Hey, hold still. There you go. Good as new. It's, well, it kind of feels all right. Well, it ain't so bad after all. What do you think? Yeah, it looks great. <laughs> what, what do you mean? That looks great. You know, thank you, Mr. Squirrel. I think that of all the people in the world I've ever met, you has got to be the most generous, kindest, nicest, nicest, loveliest friend. Okay, yeah, no need to get sentimental. Anyway, we've got to find a way out of here now. Yeah, you could be right. Yep, just typical. Oh, um, uh, anyway, Mr. Squirrel, I've, uh, I've got to go. See ya. Oh. <laughs> oh, well, suppose I'd better start swimming. Hmm, don't like the look of those wires. Better be quick. Now, I used to get stuck here a lot as a kid, so hopefully this won't be as difficult as I remember it. Let's go to the one that says exit. See, so I have all these dangly wires now, and the water is rising, so you have to not only get out of the rising water, but cut the electrical wires so that way you can get through the water without being killed. Music stops, but so I think it's safe for me to swim across to the next section. Let's see if this water was still electrified, I wouldn't be able to make it across to the next area. I think I got them all. Now, I used to get stuck there a lot. I, I, I think right at the beginning, there's one that's kind of down and to the right. And if you don't know, it'll kind of look below where you're standing. I think that was always the one that tricked me up. So either that that's easier than I remember, or I'm just not a child and could figure out that. A little quicker. I don't need the chocolate. It's the guy from the beginning of the game. Be foreshadowing. Mm. No, the money running out of his pockets. Okay, so this is the money we saw through the gate earlier. And now it's time to climb the water. The gigantic B button. around 
Let's, there we go. I thought there were wasps that... Ah, uh, there they are. It's like, I thought I remembered there being another obstacle to this. And of course the game added these guys in. <laughs> oh, that's great. The bridge is in the way. Okay, go, go, go. Yeah, those guys really take you by surprise the first time if you don't know they're there. Okay, now... If I mess this up, I have to climb this whole thing over again, so let's hope I get it right the first time. There we go. to climb down gracefully. It's funny because the game kind of has the auto camera effect where when you change direction the camera wants to swoop behind you because that's what it did in the original game but it's because you didn't have a second analog stick to control a camera with. So since the game gives you both a camera that you can control and also tries to guess the direction that you're turning sometimes they fight each other where I'm expecting the camera to not move until I tell it to but then sometimes it tries to move to help me. And it doesn't always help. I haven't talked to any of the bees yet, have I? Maybe I have to talk to the flower first. I need to talk to the flower, I think, so I can interact with the bees. Can you help me out here? <laughs> There's a guy over there, he said he wants to... Someone to win stigmas. Not quite sure. Pollinate you? That's a bit strange, but... Go away. Ooh, that big tail of yours is far too tickly. <laughs> no, no, you don't understand. Hey... Get that big, long, hairy tail away from me. <laughs> I'll suit yourself, then. Hmm. Be like that. Yeah, there we go. Now we have our bee count. So in case, uh, well, you don't see that, <laughs> we need five. Oh, get out of the way. Okay, you know what? I might actually need to get rid of you so I can get the bees over here. There. Oh, I didn't think the water would hurt me. So we found out what that noise was. Terrifying. Hey, over here! Somebody over here! Jeez, what is that thing? That thing is absolutely horrifying. Oh, another wise guy! Come on, then! Cool. I'm gonna have that gold card before you know it. Now 
Oh, there they are. Come on, bees. that off. You have to hit and then run. Again, I think I'm trying to get ahead of myself. There's a specific set of bees you have to talk to first before the let you collect them. I think it's the one closest to the king. But also, when you're collecting these bees, you have to not touch the water, or you'll lose them. I'm coming, I'm coming. So there are five bundles of little bees we have to find. Yep. Now the good news is I can't outrun them, but again, if I do get wet, or if I die, I'll lose them. Come on, this way. And I remember where a couple of them are. See, I see them down there. I thought there were bees up here. I think that's how I found that hidden tail. But... possible they moved them, but I don't know why they would have done that. Maybe they were too hard to find. Touch the water. Ah, there, there. It was down this way. All right, that's three. You like the droning sound of bees. Quickly, the last one is like way up high. supposed to get onto the roof of this, but I'm pretty sure I used to just do it this way. Because yeah, otherwise you have to go the long way around. And this is a lot faster.
and I'm not seeing them. Are they higher up than this? I thought they were just on the barrel. Maybe I have to get closer to see them. I guess we'll keep climbing. Oh no! <laughs> the camera got stuck in the barrel. Okay, well, I have to start over. But there was one batch I couldn't find. So let's start at the top and work my way down, because I know where the other four are. Because I thought it was right there on the rim of that barrel, but I did not see them. I don't know if they're actually marching and saying duct tape, but it sure sounds like he's saying duct tape. Okay, so they're still not up here. They've got to be on that barrel. I must have just missed them somehow. why they would have done that, but I am not seeing them. Well, that was luck. Hmm. Well, I guess I'll have to look where that last B set is, because I am not finding it. Eh, I guess we'll go ahead and stop it there. Again, guys, this was more Conquer Live and Reloaded. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a good one.